Hey guys, it's TJ Graney and Rick McGee. And we're coming to you for KOZ TV October, no, September 2021. Yep, Let's and this start month all, it's Let's going. start all over again. Billy just cut that out. Hey, Billy. <laughs> okay, uh, KOZ TV October, September. Start again. Hey guys, it's TJ Graney and Rick McGee. And we're coming to you live. Well, that's not live, but we're coming to you with KOZ TV for September. And this month it's Foul Feathers, Quacking and Shooting. So last year I went with my oldest son, Cody Ryan, our bass, KOZ bass fisherman, and we went to Mexico on a dove hunt. You can drive from Texas right into Mexico. Went with a friend who had a place there and we were, it was incredible. Dove everywhere, never experienced anything like that. My usual dove hunting is if the limit's 12, I have three birds. And so I got 12 my, boxes of shells though. 12, 12 <laughs> boxes of shells for three birds. Uh, and man, what a beautiful thing it is to be able to go bird hunting and, uh, and I know every year we talk about it. Some of you guys are big duck hunters. You just love getting in that water. You'll go out when it's zero degrees and raining and you don't care because you're going duck hunting. Man, the passion and the love that comes from a guy who's just into bird hunting or, or busting clays is something that we really want to translate. Just the, um, the uh, passion for the adventure that is the shooting uh, bird hunting and shooting and it could even go into turkey hunting but really I think we're talking more about the flying birds uh, migrating birds those kind of things and so this month super good month to do uh, either you know have a duck hunter come in show them all this gear you know there's a lot of great projects duck hunters ducks unlimited will let you help do with you yeah sometimes you can put up shooting uh, uh, wood duck boxes yep and things like that and so look into your duck hunting buddies and du chapters for projects you might could do because they could have a blast getting on a boat with a box maybe they build the the duck box yeah and donate them to the to the du group in your area um, lots of great things if nothing else you can go skeet shooting or it, even if you just um, spread through a, a a batch of woods you put a bunch of uh, cans hanging from string and you do a bb gun run through there and just do some shooting and uh but teach them about waterfowl and about migrating birds and dove and you know they go from here to mexico and and all those kind of things um man i, I think a lot of groups have often uh shot ski they've taken advantage they maybe did some shooting with long guns or short guns uh on a on a bench during uh july and they use this month to shoot ski. Show those boys what a shotgun is, break it apart, um, how to how to lead a, a, a ski, how to get right on it, and don't be intimidated by it moving. So it's a great time to be on a ski range. So teach them about that, sh shooting the shotgun, shoot where you look, the whole concept of, of bird hunting and shooting. Um, don't forget, it's this year we're talking about do hard things. It's been our theme all year. What a beautiful, um, what a beautiful uh, quote to use in just about anything with the boys that they can go from not to being able to do something and that, and that they leave knowing that they can do hard things. Well, this year's do hard things is to, is to call up an older somebody in their yeah, life. The DHT challenge at the very end of your curriculum. Don't forget that. Yeah. The, the, the challenge is to get those boys to, to, to call a grandmother, a grandfather, uh, uh, maybe someone they just admire or look up to. Uh, uh, and it could be anybody, an aunt, uncle, someone from out of town. And just say, hey, I was thinking about you and, and wanted to just give you a call. Do you know how surprising and how encouraging that'll be to a, an older someone? And it's you teaching those boys, no, don't just receive all this love. Be willing to reach out and give love to someone. And it also talks about a text does not count. And so they get so caught up, we get so caught up in the ease and the non-confrontal, the, the 
just it's shooting somebody a text and you're on to the next thing. But when you have a phone call, you have to connect, you have to participate in it. And we want the boys to do hard things, make that connection in a phone conversation. So challenge them to do that at the end of the day. And the scripture this month is... is it's in Genesis and it's about, it's got some birds in it. Genesis 120, it was about creation. God said, let the water swarm with swarms of living creatures and let birds fly above the earth and above the expanse of the heavens. It's really a great time and place to drive home with the boys. God created this for us. It's an amazing gift that the Father gives us. To blow out of the air. <laughs> and, and, and take the breast out of it and bake it, wrap it in bacon. And if you go Texas style, slide a little jalapeno and cream cheese in there, put it on the grill, change your boys' life. Well, so guys, just want to tell you, we love you. Um, check your calendars, check your emails. Um, the Texas HTL gathering is coming up in a couple of weeks. We're trying to put one together for- Missouri. Missouri. We're looking for actually a place to do it there. If you're in the Missouri area, holler at us if you have a, a place that we might consider just email Rick or I or call the office. Um, really anxious for you guys to come to Texas and visit us at the new KOZ World Headquarters, 404 Main Street in Smithville, Texas. Um, you're welcome to come and visit us. We'd love to see you. If you need anything at all, just, uh, just call us, holler at us. Awesome place. All right, we love you guys. We'll talk to you on KOZ TV coming up, another episode coming up soon. Regulators. Mount up.